good afternoon you guys so it's sunday and it's been like the loveliest perfect sunday one important and exciting thing that i did today is i went live on my youtube channel it was my second ever live stream i spoke to everybody one on one i answered every single question that was asked of me my mom joined me for like half of it at least she's usually very shy but i prepared her now and i asked her i said please come so she did come and it was great to chat with everybody about everything i guess and i hope i can make this a regular feature because one hour of live stream passed just like that i do want to do this more often but it's simpler to do on holiday where things are little like less chaotic than they tend to be at home i guess now and we're just going to the local store i don't even really think we need anything right not really maybe some beer beer we managed to get that off the couch also so now he's running he's like way ahead of us he's not running he just <laughs> walked ahead he's running <laughs> Good morning everyone. So I can't believe it's the last few days of our holiday but it had to happen sooner or later. So today I thought I'll get some more things done and I picked up my camera to vlog again. One of the main things we've done all these days is every single day we have made sure to go out <laughs> and buy bread. So that has been a constant. I think we've only missed one day so far of the entire trip. Otherwise we have always bought bread. Obsessed. with pori it has been a good day of shooting so i filmed a get ready with me video and i also have this beautiful dress on it's bright and tropical and i really like it and i kind of don't want to change out of it but the shoot is done and i need to go sit for lunch so i thought i'll come and say hi looking like this and now i have to change what is that mama this smells of me So mom roasted some beef yesterday and it smells so good and tastes even better so delicious it's evening now and where are we going mama to the beach we're going to the beach we've only been once on this trip earlier and i didn't even take my camera that day i just took my gopro and then i forgot to like film anything so today i'm taking my camera and we're headed to the beach let's hope i don't get sand up and everything that would be nice We're here at the beach and it looks so different from when we came last week because it was totally empty last week but here right behind me you guys should be able to see the beach shacks are being built they are a part of goa beach culture they're also a huge menace but if you want to eat or drink anything at the beach you can at these shacks so they're just being constructed and they'll last like until april may until april may when they'll be taken down again because of monsoon so i guess This is an important period. It's still a little sunny, so the beach is pretty empty, and it looks just beautiful. Come on. Come on. Come on. What, what is that one's name? That um, one's Betty. 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 Beautiful. <laughs> no. Betty still pumps and she likes to ride. Yeah. <laughs> we came near the lifeguard station to take some photos, and we just met the sweetest little girls. They are friends with. all of the local dogs here and they're treating them so well the elder ones instructing the younger one on how to hold the puppy properly and yeah it's just the sweetest thing and it made my heart so warm <laughs> look what has happened to my mother there 
are coming to you. <laughs> what are you all even up to? Come on, Daddy. I have three. Batty. Come on, Batty. Don't need Pee Wee. Won't move. leave them some space guys. This dog has been following us since we reached the beach and he's all the while coming and sitting near me or falling on me. No, he just came and sat there, right? Correct. I didn't call him. You have company. <laughs> about missing the bread man today and then I heard the glorious horn <laughs> and we have bread. Bye bye. Bye bye. Good. The puns. waiting for the bus. Mum's with me. So we're going to Margao. Only she was supposed to go but at the last minute I also joined literally while she was about to step out. We're just going to do like shopping for the stuff we need to take back to Bombay basically. like to see what exactly we shopped for you're in luck because I'm gonna show you many of y'all might be aware of my love for this bag that I bought from H&M a few months ago and I call this uh, my French fisherman bags while my mom always teased me and said that this reminded her of like woven bags that you get in Margao market I did fill this bag with our loot from the market Cashew nuts, first of all. This is my mother's favorite brand. It's Zante's. Uh, she has been buying from this brand for years together and she doesn't buy any other brand if she can help it. So these are all Zante's cashew nuts. They're different types. Uh, some of it is steam roasted, so it's still got a little bit of the shell which you can easily break off. And there are also salted and masala ones which make excellent like munchies thing that I have in here pickles from this brand called Mac Benz also one of my mom's favorite brands because there are a few others like karma goanas etc she finds them spicy so she likes Mac Benz and this is basically fresh prawn balchow balchow is a type of um, masala so it's usually used as a pickle 
or sometimes it's even used as a main dish or a side dish and it's sweet it's savory it's yummy this one has prawn or shrimp in it but you can actually prepare balchao with even meat or vegetables that's rarer though this is not even all the balchao that we bought my mom has some of it and also the store didn't even have as many as she wanted she wanted more but it didn't have it in stock <laughs> I'm in the jacuzzi again you guys and I also have a full face of makeup and curled hair just because I already uh, shot a video just now and I was like why not come like this so I'm super glamorous also I have a beer here you're not supposed to drink at the jacuzzi so I'm officially breaking a rule and because I forgot before this cheers we're having our lunch and tomorrow we've kept free because we still do have to pack everything and all we're leaving day after tomorrow after oh, that, yeah, we have visitors tomorrow as well. Mum has made us some yummy lunch. We are having a mixed vegetable pulao with some pork sorbetel and pickle. We are checking out of our room in the next half an hour, and later today we are headed back to Bombay. And I'm really happy because this was like the nicest trip. That's it for this vlog and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.